Call me Master Zangas, I'm a flippy bands. Hello, man. You see the title, bro? Uh, I got like, I don't know, maybe like 30 minutes or 20 minutes to write this video before electricity over here goes. Yeah, just now they live in South Africa, bro. Yeah. Low uh, electricity cuts. They're gonna do it. Earn money by doing the least. How do you earn money by doing the least amount of work possible? Reaction videos. Well, the answer is simple. It's called React Content. Why spend time and effort coming up with anything original when you can just react to other people's creativity? Is it stealing? <laughs> maybe, but just like Logan Paul's crypto scam. Hey, man. Shit. They say it's acceptable when you edit a little bit, whatever, or do something or add like comment. I don't know, bro. Hey, man, that's the money method, bro. It, it, I'm gonna be real with y'all niggas. Everybody, I'm not trying to like grow a community or of like people that think I'm out here thinking my shit or like, bro, I rather grow a community of niggas knowing, hey, man, a lot of the reason why I'm doing YouTube is for the money and for the fun of it. So, shit, as long as it's still legal to do reaction videos. Everybody finna continue doing them, so niggas cannot get mad. There's no consequences. Take a look at the YouTuber Waka Waka, who gives a shit. Waka likes to react to my content and has made a ton of money doing it. My high school vid netted him 550,000 views, which translates to about five to eight hundred dollars. That's half a G for a vid he put no <coughs> effort into making. No insightful analysis of my nuanced viewpoints, just some basic white girl expressions of you're so big. Now, I know it. Uh, uh, how do I put this? I don't know. I have seen his videos. Nick, I'm trying to be like him. Shit, that nigga, that nigga getting a lot of views, man. I'm sure he makes some money. Huh? But I don't know, bro. Me, when I click on his videos, I feel as if he's adding, like, quote-unquote, value to the video because, like, the shit he's saying, his edits, bro, he edits more than me. So, I don't even know. And this goofball saw my reaction. This goofball. This goofball saw my reaction of it. So, Hey man, hopefully I'm putting in some value things, but I do be, I'm not gonna lie, I do be stretching the videos, not literally, I be, bro, I'm just a chatter, bro, and because I have a problem of not being able to speak English properly sometimes, uh, so I be having my times where I gotta think and the video ends up being longer than it is supposed to be, like, you see, I don't know, bro, I feel as if it's some, I don't know, not even some, I like his videos, the editing, the shit he be saying, the way he laughs is like, it's, it's entertaining. It seems like I'm making fun of him. And I am, but I don't blame him. He figured out a way to cheat the system. I never blame people for taking advantage of Bro, bro, plug. Someone please plug me with his method, boy. That nigga get abused, man. Rules. I always blame the rules. So if YouTube allows you to take other people's content and ruin it by sprinkling in some fake Jimmy Fallon laughs, then go ahead. I mean, <laughs> humans have been making React content for decades. Back when I was a kid, America's Funniest Home Videos was one of the most watched shows in the country, which was basically just a low-res TikTok with less jailbait teens. Since then, there have been countless shows where a dude just stands in front of a green screen and reacts to content on the internet. I mean, what do they even show on MTV besides ridiculousness? Apparently, America loves the sound of a Wait, 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 wait. I've never even thought about this. Ridiculousness is literally reaction content, but on a TV. Yo, this nigga put us on. He put us, okay, not actually, I actually know my research. The first people to do this reaction thing, I, I think they called them the Fine Brothers. I don't know. I just know it's just two white guys. One of them is like, I want to say something about his eyes, but. You know what? I don't want the karma uh, or trying to make fun of people with, with me yet. Yeah, I don't know, man. Yeah, they put us on. I'm getting pegged. <laughs> So stop thinking hard work is how you become successful. Mexicans are some of the hardest workers out there, and I can't think of. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm gonna say this. Yeah, I know I'm a lazy ass nigga, bro. I hate editing. You see, bro, my videos are hardly edited, and the reason, and I do wake, I do be waking up every day and say, bro, bro, I wish I was like a. How do I put this? I don't know why, why was I born like this? I, 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 cannot, I cannot even blame my own parents. I'm not even going to blame my parents. I'm not those type of dudes that be blaming everything on their parents. But just like this, bro, both of my parents are hardworking people. But me, bro. Yeah, I'm like, how do I put this? I'm a lazy ass nigga. I don't like to do a lot of shit. So I don't even know how the fuck. Why am I so different from them? I'm literally a dare biological kid. It's now on some like adoption type of thing. There's nothing wrong with being adopted, but I'm literally their biological kid. So it means I will have their traits, but they are not lazy people, but I am lazy. I don't know. 
maybe they could say is that because of the times I'm born in, life is much easier. That's the reason why I'm lazy. Uh, a lot of things are like literally a lot of the, the things you're supposed to do in life. Uh, they're taking care about it. I don't even know, man. One CE. Hopefully, hey man, if you see this video, bro. Hopefully, if you check out my other videos, that I read to your videos, man. I'll be putting uh, for me some commentary. I'll be chatting. I do be chatting. You feel me? Adding some like little commentary. Bill named Jesus. <laughs> Capitalism doesn't reward hard work. It rewards you for exploiting other people's. That's what they say, man. Don't work hard work smart hard work you think bezos is welding steel in his new warehouse <laughs> no fuck no him. he'd be 20 stories up saying how do i get these undesirables to work faster believe me they ain't no calluses on his hands so if you're not talented and <sighs> looking for easy ways to earn bread then be like darkness over here and start stealing but why don't i make react content you may be asking yourself i got over 700 000 subs i'm bound to get a bunch of views why do i spend 25 hours writing one vid <laughs> when i can make five in an hour think about how much money i can make the resources the women hey, Hey man, tap in with the hey man, it's the new money glitch man, reaction content. The power I can have, I can feel it, I can feel it creeping in, but I'm not quite there yet. Because the older I get, the more I think about what my purpose is in life. What do I want to achieve hmm. before leaving this plane of existence? Is it just to acquire stuff? Because that's why I used to think. During COVID time, I bought a whole bunch of stuff trying to fix my sad brain. I got a sofa that feels like you're floating on fun bags, a massive TV to watch corn on, a bit I'm glad this guy doesn't show his face because the amount of shit he be saying, bro, is like literally exposing yourself on the internet, bro. Shit, I don't, shit. Hey, man, he making money from that shit, so it's like, selling, you're selling your soul. It's basically selling your soul. <sighs> Just another day trying to make a dollar, man. Shit, we live in a fucked up world, man. Trying to make the best out of it. Day that feels like a stroke victim is tossing your salad. But none of them made me feel better because true happiness comes from people. The experiences and connections you make with one another. Road trips with the homies, cuddling after lovemaking. Uh, me personally, bro, I'd rather, uh, my homies finna get on me this. Oh, so you rather make money than be friends of? No, goofball. Look at this, bro. How the fuck is we finna be able to chill, uh, and enjoy life? Why we're broke? Why we don't have money? So me personally, bro, hey man. But nah, my homies are literally the right friends for me because they know, bro. Hey man, work first, chill after. Roll that dude. We am converse. Not just dude, that's uh, also females too. Do not fuck your female friends, bro. It's fucking hell, man. Stations in the back of your friend's car are the reasons life is worth living. No one is dying and thinking about their Gucci belt unless it's wrapped around their neck. So try to stop <laughs> thinking money is the ultimate goal when it's just a tool to get you. Uh, I cannot. I, it's like this, bro. Yeah, I know there's more to life than always trying to put the work in, trying to get money or whatever. But it's like this, bro. You're trying to discover life, uh, trying to find new hobbies. That uh, you do them just for the doing them, and then you you uh, you come back to uh, real life. You're broke. You're still living in your in your parents' crib. Uh, your parents are like literally reaching the age of pension or like their time of like to them not like bro. They are reaching a time where you have to defend for yourself. For so, so it's like there's no time to be chilling out here, bro. It's either gonna get a job or you are gonna die poor or you are gonna be living a life poor or like uh, a sad life. Yeah, so it's like, bro, fuck it. I literally wake up every day to and do something, try to find ways, ways to make money so uh, I don't uh, be depressed. Like, shit, life is always shit, so. Like, you know you can, like, there's many things that are happening in life or, like, there's many problems you have and you know you can, like, and for the fact that you know you can, like, uh, remove those problems if you gotta do this, my nigga, do those shits. Don't be just say, oh, man, Hey man, hey, it's gonna be okay. Uh, with time, things will be okay. This and that. Fuck no, nigga. It's either you do something or not. So shit. As long as reaction content is uh, allowed by YouTube, there's nothing wrong about it because YouTube allows it. The thing is that if you don't want people reacting to your videos, then obviously you can tell people to, to not write to your videos. If at the end of your video he said, don't write to my content. Hey man, I'm gonna apply to them, nigga. I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm obliged. I'm not going to say, no, what the hell are you talking about? Reaction content is allowed. That's why people be saying sometimes if you're into some, some people's uh, content, always ask them for, to react to it. It's like, you try to hit them up. Some of them, you try to hit them up. Or some people don't have a problem with that. Mr. Beast literally said he doesn't have a problem with people reacting to his content. 
I'm literally going off a tantrum. Hopefully this is uh, enough commentary I'm adding value to the video. <laughs> where you need to go. But even with that said, I still want more money. Because the more money I can make, the greater impact I can have on humanity. Hard to build 100 wells in Africa when my credit card keeps getting declined. Plus, it's probably a good idea for me to have a safety net with how many pedo jokes I make. Unrelated, if you're <coughs> watching this, Father Cunningham. I still remember what you did. So I'm gonna Wait, was he, was he touched as a kid? I don't want to know, bro. Yeah, that, that, yeah. I'm going to be ignorant. I'm going to be ignorant to those type of things. That's why, hey, man, I'm not getting into politics. Weird spot, because I love the vids I've made on this channel, but they are taking me longer and longer to write. Originally, wait, don't, don't you have, like, editors? He said he pays people to, uh, to construct the video. Oh, the writing, the jokes, they're coming up with the jokes. Okay, okay, yeah. My bad, baby, dog. Hey, man, I don't know. I don't know nothing about creating, uh, Original videos, hey man, you got it, man. You the big dog. I was like, oh, let me just talk about some random topics and add some dark humor. And now I'm trying to solve complex issues like social anxiety or how to fix your ugly face. It ain't easy. This <laughs> month I'm trying to solve racism. Racism. <laughs> no biggie, right? Racism is not finna end. It's a joke, bro. I'm joking. But behind every joke, there is like a... There is some truth to it. I don't know when racism finna end because it is like this. Race, let's just say it, racism has ended. But for the fact that other people like make quote unquote dark jokes or like black people are allowed to say whatever they, the hell they want because of like the, the uh, ancestors got were like abused this and that. Because it's like this. It, it's, a, it's, a, it's a stupid uh, idea or thinking. Because uh, this person is black and uh, and this person's ancestors were like abused back then, it means they're justifiable to like say whatever the fuck they want about the, the white man, whatever. I don't know, bro. It's just racism will never end in GT, bro. <laughs> the standard I set for every video is only growing. And I'm going to be honest, I'm getting a little burnt out. Like, I need something easy I can do that doesn't require five days of writing. Bro, do Russian videos, man. Start streaming shit. That's the matter right now. That's the money glitch. The easiest thing I thought of is just to start another channel and do some react content. But like a thought with no gag reflex, I know it'll make me feel good initially, but then leave me with a deep feeling of shame. But if you guys want to start doing react content, then I ain't judging. It's been proven in multiple mediums to be an effective business model. Plus, maybe just need the money inflation rent okay now he put a uh, sqc in that bitch i am not sqc top of level hell nah now we can all agree that nigga's content before they criticize him before they showed him yo bro your video shit nigga literally reacts literally press pause and doesn't unpause the video or like i don't know quote unquote advantage to the video because he just ah, ah, guys that's funny shit ha <laughs> ha that's it but it's like, bro, who the fuck am I to say anything, bro? Shit, I be doing the same shit. But there's this thing that says I'm better than him because he doesn't actually add value to us. He, he, he be out here, bro. <laughs> now, when I found out they say this boy does a quote-unquote reaction and goes out the room and goes do something else for some time while the video is playing, he's not uh, in front of the screen. Okay, that one... Hey, bro, every could collectively agree, bro. Even the people who do reactions or even the people who, like, uh, don't do that shit, but they still, like, be laughing and not, like, posting the video and adding, like, a commentary something. Yeah, that was trash. That was trash, bro. Like, come on, man. What men are willing to settle for are all increasing. So if you want a little extra bread, then start exploiting your nearest bakery. So there you have it, the easiest <sighs> ways to print money on YouTube. If you guys have some good channel names or ideas for your boy, please let me know down in the comments. Uh, probably names more, as I really don't know what to call it. And just remember, <laughs> you don't need talent to be successful. You just need to milk other people's talent. Hey, man, shit. That's what the mainstream media is doing, man. News. Niggas be out here showing videos of other people and talk about like oh it's quote unquote but it's news it's news bro niggas are trying to do that on youtube like go outside and report like on the latest trending topics or like go interviews like survivors or something but when they put it on youtube it's quote unquote uh doesn't agree with uh youtube's terms and services but they are allowing news channels to put explicit clips on youtube but when people are out here trying to do the same thing Hey, man, shit, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Hey, YouTube, you got it, man. It's your platform. You can, like, you allow what you want. It is what it is, bitch, dog. I have no, I have no smoke with y'all boys, man. Amer oh, hell nah. I thought he, ooh. America's Funniest Home Videos, hosted by Bob. Don't pronounce if you have a lisp. Sag it. Mm, you know what you want. 
Oh, fucking hell, bro. I hate this man's outros. Oh, my goodness. Ah, uh, you look at that, bro. I'm gone. What do you do? Oh, you want to push that subscribe button? Oh, push the button. Push the button. Okay, that, okay that's enough for y'all, bro. I'm gone. <laughs> bro, I hate this man's outro, bro. Hey, man, I'm still in this video. Hopefully, hey, man, the video is four seconds. My video is 15 seconds. Hopefully, I added some value. And I, I am not XQC. I am I didn't do an XQC type of reaction, bro. I'm still in this video. Ha -ha! Stealing money. The fuck? Bro, never mind, man. Call me Mr. Zen, cause I'm a flippy bass.